key linkages between clinical education and employment is experience. When I talk with alums, they, they tell me that uh, the opportunity to do actual client interviewing, to learn client I interactions, how to interact with clients, uh, they talk about doing actual fact investigation rather than just reading about cases that come to them already digested in a case book. They're out there actually developing the cases and learning how to do that. And uh, when, I ask, when I ask former students what was it about clinic that made a difference, that's a big one, is actual client work, actual fact investigation, development, uh, and then all of the messy things that go along with real people. I almost see clinic as a place where people learn how to be plumbers and philosophers. Because you gotta know how the law works. You gotta know which court to file in and you have to remember what the deadlines are. And you have to be able to keep track of your time uh, in a way that you can then later bill clients for, all of those technical things that you have to learn. You know, have to know what law book to go to. But there is a, almost a spiritual, philosophical, emotional part to the practice of law, which is essential to start learning as soon as possible. The distinctives of our clinical program are that we have this interprofessional element where we, uh, as the law clinic piece of it, we're independent actors, but at the same time we collaborate with our partners in the center, our, uh, our partners in the School of Professional Psychology and our prof uh, partners in the School of Social Work. We have professionals in training from all three of these schools and uh, there are few, if any, places like ours in the country. And other institutions from coast to coast have been interested in how we do what we do, and frankly envious of what we do. At the same time, we do what clinical programs do everywhere. If you go to the, uh, a dentistry school, you, wanna, you want a dentist to learn that how to pull teeth and fill fillings and do x-rays, well, we have a clinical program with nine different offerings where people do get those skills of, of litigation skills, of transactional skills, of writing, of client interviewing. So we both have distinctives, but we have also uh, the meat and potatoes or the tofu and potatoes, if you prefer, of, of that kind of experience that you expect at a, at a, at a law school. Here in the IPC, we work every day with social workers and psychologists. Often our clients have a variety of needs, and uh, we uh, work very closely together. So for instance, uh, an article I wrote last year involves looking at how courts uh, view the opinions of psychologists and social workers and doctors. And so a colleague of mine here, another lawyer, Sarah Brennis, and I wrote an article looking at hundreds of administrative appeal decisions and how best to use those sorts of resources in immigration cases. And then we share that information with our students to help them actually do that kind of work.